Well, here in downtown Baton Rouge, hundreds of participants gathered for Ryan's Run this morning. As News 2's David Hamilton found out, the event is committed to raising awareness for sickle cell disease with every single step they take. One in 13 African-American babies is born with a sickle cell trait. It affects more than 100,000 individuals in the country, with around 3,000 living in Louisiana. The disease can lead to severe pain, organ damage, and even life-threatening conditions. The Baton Rouge Run is named after former LSU and NFL player Ryan Clark, who has the sickle cell trait. Lost my spleen, my gallbladder, a piece of my liver, almost my life as well. And then the next year, my sister-in-law, she died. And she had sickle cell. She died at the age of 27 after a sickle cell crisis. Ryan's Run is not just a race, but a movement that wants to bring attention to sickle cell disease. Although the run has been going on for 50 years strong, this is the ninth year the event has been called Ryan's Run. Well, I think the people that understand what sickle cell is, how it affects those who have whether the sickle cell trait or sickle cell disease, I think they know how important it is to raise awareness for it. They know how important it is to shed a light on the entire community. It doesn't matter what color you are. We all understand what it's like to fight something. We all understand what it's like to go through adversity. I think today shows that. He said he is thankful and appreciative for the community coming out in support of the awareness. Not as known, um, it's 100, r roughly 100,000 people in America that has it. So, you know, with those numbers, it's, it's not uh, everywhere. Some people haven't even heard of sickle cell. Just So just to have this many people show out, support us, um, you know, early Saturday morning, it, it really does mean a lot. Well, that was David Hamilton reporting.